The first step inject the hydraulic oil and number uh, 48 and make sure the oil level 80 80 80 and then check everything connect well the wires the oil packs next add the sensor according to the marks but not 100 persons just same like the mark we make it we made it to you and we still need to adjust when you receive the machine after that make sure the molding sticks it's in the in the same level panel same level at the panel And then check the label on the control cabinet. Is it uh, the meaning you understand? If you don't understand, you need ask our engineer. Every switch, every switch, the label, the meaning you need understand. We need to adjust the sensor's position for the five sensors and there total five. We need to adjust the sensor's position. How to adjust the position? And firstly, <coughs> we need working on the manual mode, more manual mode, the manual mode. And then we start the oil pump, the oil pump, start the oil pump and make it the materials for the for the uh, once feed the material once and then start um we need make the feeder back to the position for the uh, original position and then price up and price down testing the these three these three uh, sensors and for the upper one, for the upper one, it means the moldings, it need be the same level for this panel. If it is not the same level, then we, uh, we, need, we will need uh, just the first one, the upper one. And the middle one, the middle one means the thickness. When the price down, there will be holes and the holes will be uh, into uh, we feed in the materials into the molding holes and the middle one uh, when the molding the feeding holes the thickness is not correct and then we will need to adjust the middle one if it is the thickness is too is too uh, too too high too large and then we make it a little upper a little upper means a uh, more thin, thin thickness, and a little down make means the most more high thickness, and this one is mean the pressure, the pressure when it's working, this both meters will be changing, and when it's uh, in the correct uh, working mode, and the light the sensor will lighting, and when the pressure is not enough. And then the meter will not change, and we meet. We need make it a little down, and we get a higher pressure. And when it's uh, already finished price, and the sensor is not lighting, uh, we need make it a little upper until it's lighting. Then these are correct position. And for the bike position, and this one. This two, there are two. Uh, this one means the feeder, the moving pipes for to the moldings. If it's moving too much forward, 
we need to make it a little bike, and then it's in the correct position. And another one, we don't need to. Um, sometimes we, uh, normally we don't need to adjust it. Just this. And the most important is uh, are the these three sensors. We need adjust it to the correct position. For these three sensors, the distance here it needs to be three to five millimeter. Three to five millimeter can to be too far the distance, and both needs in a line. This pressure meter, the right one, is the max one, and we don't need to adjust it because we already make it before shaping. Make it working in the in the right right line range. Open the oil pump. Mean the hydraulic pressure is working. This is pressed down. The panel pressed down. And the middle one, we adjust the materials, the charcoal inside the thickness, the middle one. And we need to make sure. The hole when it's empty, and the middle sensor is lighting the thickness forty-five. 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 If it is not like that, and we need, uh, if it uh, thinner, and we need make the. Middle sensor more down. If it's higher thickness, and we need make the middle sensor a little uh, more up. And this is the middle one sensor. And materials forward. Materials forward means the feeder going going forward, and until it reach here, and then it's cracked. And inside. Inside the brusher, brusher will brush the dust on the uh on the upper upper sticks, so it is uh correct if it's in this position. And materials is it's distributing inside the feeder. And now materials back, the feeder back. And price up. Okay. And now we test the pressure. The pressure,、uh, if it is enough pressure by the by the bottom sensor, we feed in a little, a little charcoal dust. And with bender and water already mixed well. Materials forward. Materials back. Price down. Price down. Check. The meter, if the pressure meter is changing, and after it's reached, and after the pressure meter is changing, also the bottom sensor will lighting. If it is lighting, then all is matched. This one and this one, they all need checking. And after that, materials forward. We push the ready charcoal out and doing another the next batch.
See, if the pressure is, if the pressure is enough, and also the light, uh, the sensor is lighting, then the pressure is cracked. If it is not changing, that means the pressure is very small, and we make the bottom sensor a little more. And if the sensor is not lighting, that means the sensor position needs changing to upper or a, a, a little down. Inching, inching, adjusting by the manual mode. If you feed in too, too little charcoal dust, the hose is not fully loaded and the briquette is not good. So we need to make sure the feeding material is enough and then we get the, the good briquette. This is a high density and it's very high. After you finish each batch and you back to home, we need clean. We need clean up. We need clean up the. Mo This is making cubic shapes. If you need other shapes, please check another video I uploaded. If you have any other question, do not hesitate to contact Kim. Thanks for watching.